St. Augustine is certainly considered one of South Jersey's top teams entering the 2020 season. That makes the uncertainty of this fall all the more frustrating for the Hermits. I thought th this year was going to be our year. we got a lot of guys returning, so it's frustrating, but you just got to take it day by day to see what happens. To me, anything's better than nothing, you know, so if it's a six-game schedule and that's it, then so be it. I mean, obviously, you know, we, we'll be disappointed. We certainly would love to be able to qualify for the, for the playoffs. The Hermits did more than just qualify for the non-public Group 4 playoffs last year. They beat Seton Hall Prep and then pushed eventual champion St. Peter's Prep to the brink, falling just short in a 35-28 thriller. We seem to have been getting a little bit better every year in that regard, and you know we think we're getting closer and closer, so we would love the opportunity. The Hermits are loaded with premier playmakers all over the field. Kanye Udo, Nasir Hill, Angelo Vokalos, and Jake Ketchik are all considered among the best players in the state. St. Augustine has morphed from a team hoping to make noise in the playoffs into a legitimate state championship contender. We hope we can have a playoff. Hopefully this stuff dies down so we can go to the playoffs and prove that we're a championship caliber team and that we can mess with the big dogs up north and that we're the number one team in the state. We want to play and any games we can get in is going to be great. But if we do get to the championship, we definitely aspire to be at the top of the division. I want to win the championship. Everybody here wants to win the championship. so. I, it is frustrating not knowing what the playoffs going to be like. We do know what the regular season will look like for the Hermits. Three games against teams that won titles in 2019, and two games against teams that advanced to sectional semifinals a year ago. This is a St. Augustine squad that knows it'll be taking everyone's best shot this fall. We love it, you know, we're not ducking no smoke. We take anybody on. We just feel like we can compete with anybody, you know. They bleed like we bleed. They play like we play. So we just think it's a good target on that back. It just makes us better only, and we're always competitive and ready to play. But we like all that pressure because we have to prove every single week that we are one of our best teams in South Jersey and in the state. I mean, it just calls for a competitive game, and nobody likes to blow out games, even the team that's winning. So tough games are what you look for. A tough team gearing up for a tough schedule during some of the toughest of times. Adversity is a given in 2020. The Hermits are ready to handle it. We work hard because we know we only have a limited amount of time out here and we have to make it count when we're out here as a team. In Richland, I'm Mike Frankel, JerseySportsZone.com.